And we're back on the space station. So now we just need to get to Novus. Where is it? Uh, Terra Nova, Twilight, Proxima B, Stella, Novus. Here we go. Select and go. And because this because this one's in the same solar system, I'm assuming this one won't take as long. But it it may still take a little bit of time. So let me just come back once we're done warping. Or not. <laughs> okay, that was fast. So how many... Okay, I have I still have a lot of dilithium left. And to be fair, that's really all the warping I need to do. So basically... Basically, I can just leave... It. I can just, like... I can just take away the uh, the dilithium and we're good. Like, that's all the warping I need to do because I could just put this matter receiver on Novus and we're good to go. So, off we go. I'll be right back. No, wait. I just remembered my, uh, my rocket needs to be refueled. Kind of a problem when you forget to do that. All right. How much fuel? Okay, one more bucket. And we're good. It is a very good thing I remember. Advancement made. It's a start. Oh, it's because of my it, it's because of my uh, my experience. Okay. Uh, actually, now that I'm thinking about it, perks. Now, how many points do I have? Three. Okay. So I I can actually get to singularity. So this, then this, and this, which gives me three more points. Gain experience by building things, traveling the world. Taking damage, dealing damage. Okay, so let's do these. All right, very useful. And uh, before we pick up these last ores, uh, I'm just gonna claim these quests. And let's just see, inventory upgrade. Ugh. Uh, thanks, but no thanks. Don't want my extended inventory to be gone. Targets. Yikes. And Ward. All right. Thank you, I guess. Uh, just eat a Toasted Western. New food. And let's just put this away and go to Novus. I will be right back. Okay, from the preview on the mini-map, I'm a little concerned about this planet. <laughs> what is th What is this? Like, it just looks like there's lava and... Is that Blazing Pyrothium? Lava and blazing pyrothium, like, everywhere. What in the world? All right, well, hmm. Could have, could have landed in a worse spot, but, uh, I mean, this, this is fine, so, hmm. This is, this is a really interesting planet. Uh, ash from Biomes of Plenty. Hmm. Okay. Pile of ashes. What does this do? Gray dye, coal... Hmm. Can be used as a very simple fuel source. All right. Um, hello. There we go. Novus. All right. So, yeah, a lot of lava. Need to be careful. But this is also where I'll find the last ores that I need. So that'll be energized clathrate and and uh, nether draconium ore. So, I mean, that works. So if I just do this, I could put these somewhere and get them out of my inventory. I'll just do that. Okay. Uh, let's get, let's get my things. So digital miner, you cannot go there. Um, how about, let's take you, we'll do here. There we go. That's better. And then we just need power. And let's do silk on for both of these. So that would be ore, clathrate, glowstone, I think. Yes. So start. Nothing? Uh, that's a problem. Let's see. So, energized netherrack. Yeah, it's ore clathrate glowstone. Um, how low? How low in the planet? Um, about Y level forty-two. 
Is uh, Y level 42, maybe 41. 41 is a pretty good chance. Um, so that's weird. Start? Stop? Reset? What? Or Clathrate Glowstone. Huh. I guess maybe I need to go find it myself. Uh, hmm. All right, well, uh, I'll be ready to fly out of here just in case. Um, oh, boy. Lava planet, Kirby. It is a lava planet. That's... Woo. All right. Can I... Let's see. Reservoir. Get one of these. Let's pick up some lava, because why not? Who knows? Maybe useful for some things. Still want to avoid the lava. That would um, that would be bad. So there we go. Yeah, lava planet Kirby. Always be flying. Oh my god, I have to go so deep. Okay, uh, I'll, I'll be back as soon as I find some. This is going to take a really long time. Found some energy in Netherrack. Uh, don't really know why my... Uh, I don't really know why my digital miner isn't finding this, but I'm going to tell it... Uh, I'm going to tell it this is what it's looking for. Uh, via item stacks. If I, I mean, if I can't... If I can't find it, then... Boo. I'm going to have to come down here myself... And mine it up. So, config, uh, delete this. We're gonna want item stack, energize and netherrack. Save. And start. Nothing. All right, I'm gonna have to go and get the energize and netherrack myself. Amazing. Okay, so energize and netherrack does not work. Um, then it was draconium or so ordict or draconium save and go there we go well i mean it, so it's not going to it's not going to populate right now but all right well i'm going to need to you need to send this home and this thing's gonna need to know what to do with the nether draconium ore. So, yeah, fun. Let's see, my char, uh, my teleporter's here. Technically, my rocket can just be retired now, since I could just warp to all these planets. So, let me just land this on. Let me just land this on the space station, and I'll be right back as soon as I'm back on Novus. Alrighty, guys, my rocket is on the space station. I no longer need to use it. But now, I can finally process the last of these ores. So let's just temporarily turn off the extract on this. We'll need to tell this that these two can be a thing in here. And we'll need to say that draconium, another draconium ore will go here. Same with energize another rack. Wait, what? Hey, why are you dropping? I'm not holding alt. There we go. So the, Draco the draconium death. Oh, right. Okay, well. Energized clathrate is done. I'm going to need to bring that elsewhere. Uh, we'll see. Extract always active. So that way the, the way the draconium can smelt. Then we're good. All right, now let's get out of here and let's define a place for energized clathrate to live. And unfortunately for me, I'm go I'm gonna have to go mining myself on Novus if I if I need more energized clathrate because my digital miner does not seem to work with it for some odd reason. Let's see, drawer. Thought I had another drawer. Guess not. Uh, we'll do that. And this. 
My my uh, my digital miner is still on Novus, so I'm gonna need to go back and get it. But otherwise, let's see. Energized. There we go. So I may need to get more, but eh. I mean it's fine for right now. Uh, so back to Novus. And back to Novus to get my get my miner. Uh, Novus dial once. I'll need to get my miner, and then maybe try maybe try another planet sometime, or something. I don't know. I don't know what my plan is right now. Maybe my plan should be restart my game because uh, yikes! I've been I've been flipping tweet. Wow, I just failed on words really badly. I've been flipping between dimensions like uh, this entire time, so I'm probably gonna want uh, probably gonna want to like. Go back now. I'm gonna to want to go back to the overworld. Yeah, so I'm gonna to want to go back to the overworld, restart my game, and then figure out what I want to do. So uh I'll be right back. Alrighty guys, we are back. I just reset my game and I have a couple of oh a market. So I already have one though. Can I do something with this? I can burn it. That's it. That's all I can do with this. Fine. And a cooking table. Hmm. I feel like I already have one of those. I do. Well, uh, goodbye. Okay. Uh, I think also. I mean, since, since we're done with uh, since we're done with the uh, with the rocket stuff, I'm just gonna take this down. Like no no real need in keeping this. Uh, no real need in keeping this all set up if I if I don't even need it anymore. Which also means I should probably repair the roof. So let's see. That would be so. That would be the uh, that would be the clear glass, clear glass, and Tyrion. Tyrion. All right. I'll fix this up. So I believe. Uh, hmm. Yeah. That would, uh, yeah, this would match perfectly with the amount of materials that I've spent to open that, so. Okay, so, house repaired. And, yeah, that's, that's pretty much it. Uh, man, I'm getting, I'm getting experience so much faster in Astral now that I have, uh, now that I have the traveling thing. Uh, hmm. Oh, I should probably get my dilithium as well, because uh, technically I don't need to warp anywhere. Uh, all right, uh, off to the space station. Uh, let's clear Stella out, and uh, I'll be right back as soon as I get my dilithium. All righty, so it looks like if I want to get started with Draconic, I need to get into Extreme Reactors. There is no Extreme Reactors chamber, uh, chapter, but Nuclear Craft and Industrial Craft grant access to the mod. Cyanite, Plutonium, Ludicrite, Anglicite, and Benetoit will all be needed for the endgame. Uh... Okay, so I'm gonna need a reactor controller. So that's gonna need fission reactor casings, uranium plates, a nuclear reactor from IC2, a lead large plate, and a fission controller. And that also needs a basic crafting table. Well, either that, either that or some uh, some sort of crafting table from advanced crafting or extended crafting. So I think I may want to get started with a. I think I may want to get started with an extreme reactor. Basically, it's something that will allow me to make plutonium. So, I think that one may want to be on demand. Like, on demand crafting for plutonium. So, let's just see. Uh, hold on. Plutonium? Uh, how do I make this? Uh, oh! Tiny piles of plutonium. Mana infused. Cyanite. Cobalt. Empowered Palis. So basically, I need uh, basically I need two blocks of cyanite to get one block of plutonium, and I think yeah, that's uh, used for stuff. Okay, that's uh, whew. so ender amethyst, alumite, blaze mesh, elementium, indirium. Yeah, I'm gonna need to get auto crafting for that stuff, but uh, I think for right now, uh, for right now, my goal should be this. Uh, let's see, uh, extended. Okay, well, I don't have uh, I don't have a uh, I don't have a basic crafting table, but 
Hold on, is there stuff in the basic crafting table that I need to auto craft? Hmm. Stuff that could only be made in here. Creative Builder's Wand, uh, Void Arm Miner, Tier 6. Nothing that I need to auto craft, I don't think. Um, quantum Compressor. Elite Compressing Factory. That would be the. Um, so that would be the elite tier installer that I was talking about earlier. Yeah, that needs plutonium. So, okay, let's just get let's just get this out. It's not it's not going to be it's not going to be perfect, but it's something. So, fission uh, fission reactor casings need basic plating and tough alloy. So, basic plating. Oh, you know what? Now that I'm thinking about it. Let's get uh, let's get the nuclear craft upgrades. Let's see, uh, nuclear craft don't have those. Okay, so uh, nuclear speed. I'm gonna want to teach this thing how to do these upgrades because my machines are kind of slow. Uh, I'm gonna need to teach it how to do a heavy weighted pressure plate. Nope. Energy. Energy. Spell it correctly, Kirby. Jesus. Okay. Then we need to do this. Uh, hold on. Nether quartz. Yep, it's nether quartz dust. So, does this thing know how to make light weight of pressure plates? Light? Nope. You're going to need to teach this thing how to do that. And I'm going to need more patterns. Pattern. 40 of them. Because why not? Alright, and those are all in here. Now let's just double check. I don't, uh, I was going through the footage for last episode and I thought, I thought I saw a duplicate of recipe. So black, nope. Okay. We're good. I thought I saw, I thought I saw a duplicate, but turns out it's just me going crazy. All right. So let's see here. I think the manufactory is one that's, uh, well, the manufactory, uh, oh, actually, the manufactory, the isotope separator, and the alloy furnace are both pretty slow. So, are all pretty slow. So, let's see. Uh, speed. Nuclear craft. So, let's do 30 of these. Energy. Well, this one's going to take just a bit longer. Hey, yeah, that, that one's just going to take a... Uh, that one's going to take just a bit longer because it's because it needs obsidian. So, yeah. Don't really need this anymore. Because I can just warp to the planets. Alright, how am I how am I under, how am I upgrades doing? Oh, yeah, the manufacturing. Hang on, what's making nether quartz dust? I don't know which machine's making nether quartz dust, actually. It's my crusher, okay. Hmm. Okay, definitely time for me to. Yeah, it's definitely time for me to get uh, get some more uh, power up and running. Uh, is that a? Oh, it is a. a it is a. Uh, it is a solar eclipse. So, actually, I don't think. I think as of. Uh, I think as of like some version in Astral, it doesn't doesn't work uh, guaranteed as a as a way to see Horlogium. So. Okay, so. I'm definitely gonna need. I'm definitely gonna need some. Uh, I'm definitely gonna need some. Some like things. Okay. I need to get my thoughts together. So basically, I want to get some tier installers. But if I if I want to be able to craft multiple of these at a time, I don't want to have to go to. I don't want to go down here, and get and get uh get like a bunch of uh, a bunch of steel casings. I just I just want to get I just want to have like automatic replication of everything that I can replicate that I will need in here. Like I just want to be able to get some automatic replication. So yeah. Um so how are my upgrades doing? Okay, energy's done. Speed. They're done. Perfect. All right. Uh so I mean, the, the fluid infuser is fast enough. There we go. 
I didn't even know I could right click this. With these. Hmm. How much power is this using? Uh, 11,000 RF a tick. Jesus. That's a lot. But do I regret it? Eh, not really. All right. Uh, I'm going to need some. Uh, maybe I should do. Yeah, let's do 10 more. And then energy. Back in a bit, as soon as the nether quartz is done uh, being crushed. All right, well, I have a couple of things I want to do. First, th uh, first, uh, one of the things I want, I definitely want to do is automate the replicator. Just like, uh, just like get, I get automatic replication of everything that I need, like everything that can be replicated because, uh, well, maybe av except advanced computers, but uh, everything else, yeah. Gonna want some, I'm gonna want some replication like some automatic replication for these things. So I'm thinking, I'm thinking I may want to get some crystals, uh, some crystal memory. Let's say crystal memory. How do I make this? Uh, crystal memory raw needs silicon dioxide, which is a pressurizer of clay dust. All right. So, and then I'll say raw silicon dioxide, clay dust is manufactory of a clay block. So one clay block, e or no, one clay, five clay blocks is a crystal memory. So I'm gonna need 13 of those. Uh, I'm just gonna, gonna, I'm just gonna double check. No, 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 I just need 12. So 60 clay blocks, so clay. All right. Well, actually 15, actually just 59 because I have extra clay dust. Hmm. Let's just uh, pressurize this really quickly. Then we need to manufacture this, I believe. Uh, hold on. Clay dust. Uh, yeah, it has to be manufactory. Okay. So. Oh yeah, that's that's highly worth it. Like that's it. That's pretty worth it. Except now it doesn't. It does can't extract fast enough. Awkward. All right. Uh. Hmm. Yeah. Just I'm just gonna do this manually for. Uh, there we go. Give me the clay dust, except one. All right, and then we just need to pressurize this. Perfect, perfect. All right, now we just need, uh, let's see, silicon dioxide. Clay coated glowstone dust? What is this? Glowstone nanoparticle? Okay, what is this? Grinding down glowstone into ultra fine particles allows the dust to hang in the air forever. One handful of nanoparticles can cover up to 16 blocks. Has a chance of hurting the undead. Oh, nice. So then, let's see. Silicon dioxide needs one obsidian per. So I'm gonna need. Uh, I'm gonna need. 12 sets of this, so so basically 12, uh, 12 obsidian in the enrichment chamber and we're good. Uh, where's my enrichment chamber, by the way? Is it this one? Yeah, it's this one. Okay, so just let uh, let this work, uh, let this do its thing, and then we'll get some crystal memory. Crystal memory. That'd be the raw. It, okay. Uh, then we just do quick smelt. Oh yeah, these don't stack. Okay. Uh, interesting note. And now we just need to get these patterns. So export. That'd be the steel casing. Export. All right, I'll be right back. All right. And we have all of the crystal memories that I need for all these things. And hmm, I think I may need separate pattern storages for all of these, actually. I just realized that. Um, so I think the way I want this to work, uh, so I'm gonna need patterns, let's say pattern storage. Needs, oh boy. Okay, so I'm gonna need, uh, okay, I'm gonna need two blank crystal memories per 
Oh, jeez. Okay. Um, I mean, unless somehow the replicator can take the crystal memory. I think it may need... How does this work? Um, hang on a second. All right, that's 12 pattern storages. Uh, I needed to craft a lot of stuff for that. So, yeah, I really hope this is worth it. Then we need replicators. All right, let's see. Replicator. Needs three teleporters, two reinforced stone. Oh boy, be right back. So much crafting, oh my god. Okay, well I have 12 replicators and 12 pattern storages. Oh my god. That's the first thing I have to say is, oh my god, that is a lot of stuff. And I'm going to want to bump up the amount of UU matter that I am making. Because, my god, man. I do not... I, I, it just... Ugh. All right. What's that? Is that a greater sprite? Huh. Sprite. What are you doing here? How did you... I don't even... What? I don't even understand. Huh. Okay then, uh, moving on. So, I actually had the idea to use the... Uh, use this compact machine as my... Well, as my, like... How do I how do I say it uh, as my replication? I, I could also use it as my garden cloche because I mean I, I do need a place to put my garden cloches. I need to put something away. Uh, put these things away for the moment. Uh, I'm gonna need a tunnel. I don't have a tunnel. All right, a tunnel from compact machines needs a wall, a hopper, and eight redstone. All right, well nine redstone technically. So redstone. Right back. What am I doing? I already have tunnels in there. Because, I mean, there's a, there's already a proxy on this. Uh, I can just take this and the proxy, then I'll be good to go. And that, we'll need to put the compact machine elsewhere. And by elsewhere, I mean, like, right here. Not there. Not that. Uh, the compact machine. There. All right. And which side is... All right, you know what? I'll just go inside and figure it out. Um, down is the laboratory block. All right, uh, up north. Here we go. So that's where I want. Uh, that's where I want that to go. Uh, I'm gonna need some cables. Okay. Yeah, and because I rebooted my game, I can't. I can't do the. I can't do the cheaty thing of. Uh, hey, I'm in a different dimension, but uh, I could still use my crafting terminal. All right. Uh, I'm gonna need some universal cables. Uh, probably, probably more of these. Uh, let's get some atomic alloy. I mean, that shouldn't take too long, I hope. There we go. Perfect, perfect. Making the atomics. All right. So, some ultimate universals. We'll go in here and use them for this stuff. All right, uh, so I'm gonna need to do, let's see. So the, so the pattern storage has to be touching it somehow. Um, oh, and I forgot my, forgot item conduits. That's the important part to this. Well, one important part. Uh, I need my item conduits before I can actually do anything. What will happen next? Be sure you stay in the next episode of Enigmatica 2 Expert Mode. Mm -hmm.